Hi everyone and welcome to the Stoke City Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary position and very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Stoke City up against Manchester United. Hi Derek, thank you. Thank well, both you. managers will be reminding their players how important it is to start off the game really quickly. Really attack the opposition, put them on the back foot, see what comes of that. Hopefully we get a good game. Lucas. Well, high marks for that pass. By no means on his own here. Well, let's see about the cross. Read it magnificently and intercepted. There it is! And just the ideal start! Well, Derek, it's all about the cross. It's perfectly weighted. And he attacks the ball. That's the key to that goal. The opening goal of the game then. Joao Felix. Well, that's a moment the fans won't soon forget. Nothing wrong with that idea. Oh, and that is an audacious chip. Well, he might smile. The goalkeeper has no interest in smiling. Well, here it is again, Derek, the audacity of it, the skill, the techers, everything, all those words you want to use, absolutely brilliant. The keeper doesn't know what he's going to do, and neither did we. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out, one apiece. Well, there's been quite the focus on him coming into today's game. And the reports have been confirmed. He's decided to end what has been a brilliant career at the end of this season. A huge loss for the club, you've got to say, Lee. Well, how do you fill that gap, Derek? Such a great player, senior pro. Pros like him with his CV are worth a waiting goal, a manager's dream. He'll be sadly missed. Tempele, can he give them the lead? Still alive. And given away. Well, they're conceding too many chances, and the crowd sense that too. They're trying to urge their team on. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. He's in with a chance. And he favors it. Will he finish? And they've only gone and applied that finishing touch. Here's the replay, and I can see why the keeper's a little frustrated. He thought he got enough on that to keep it out, but it's just come past him, and he's unlucky, really. So back in business. Can Manchester United come up with an answer? Havertz. Joao Felix. Dybala. Manchester United getting players forward and moving the ball around. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Chilwell, a chance to whip it in. Dybala. Havertz, real danger. And they've won possession again. Throw in to Manchester United. De Jong. Dembele looks promising this running with the ball confidently well he went for placement but it didn't go to plan well we just see his body position there he's trying to open himself up bend it into that corner but he got it all wrong there's been a goal in the Manchester City match let's hear about it from Alan it's a goal for Manchester City 26 minutes played 1-0 thanks as ever for the update Alan Chilwell. He succeeds in clearing it. Joao Felix. And Kai Havertz. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Stoke City have not had too much of the ball, have they? But to their credit, they've been absolutely blistering on the counter-attack. They just sit back, hit you on the break, and it's really working for this team. Mbappe. Well, visionary passing. 
It has to be. Goalkeeping of the very highest order. Oh, it was a great shot as well. Great shot, great save. Mbappe. Now Dybala. Well, it was a very good-looking move, but alas, no end product. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Miranda. He's got space. And played in. Smuggled away. Havertz. Here's Chilwell. And just failed to keep the ball in play that time. Well, what on earth happened there? And it might be a favourable situation, this, for Manchester United. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Will they get themselves level here? Splendid defending, and it needed to be. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Options in the centre. And crossed in the direction of the back post. And thwarted. Just too close to the goalkeeper in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, poor technique, really. The goalkeeper's not troubled. Running room galore for United. A real opening now. What an important piece of defending. The first half here comes to an end. Second half is underway here, and Manchester United are behind. Here's Chilwell. Havertz. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Getting forward. Can't miss, surely! And how about that for... Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal. And now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, here's the replay. The keeper's made a save, but it's not good enough. It's back into play. But he was first to react, and it's in the back of the net. So there it is. 3-1, the current scoreline here. Let's get an update from the Etihad Stadium where a goal has been scored, Alan McAnally. It's a second goal for Manchester City. 52 minutes please. 2-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. So the corner played into the box. Not to be this time. Nowhere to go, really. He's being closed down. Hakimi. Kai Havertz. And providing width. Hakimi, opportunity for them to get back into the game. Hard. And the keeper has custody of the ball, but just a few seconds beforehand, he had a big save to make. Well, keep hold of it, have a breather, because that first save deserves us all to look at him and clap. Manchester United getting players forward and moving the ball around. And very deftly cut out. And we very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Stoke City taking on Brighton. Yeah, atmospheres make games, Derek, and that should be an absolute belter. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Well, excitement guaranteed here on EA TV Live, the Champions League semi-final second leg. It's Manchester United facing Manchester City. Yeah, it surely has to be an epic game. Two sides doing everything in their power to make it to the final. All on the line. Has to be a cracker, Derek. Campbell. And it's with Etebo. Patient enough build-up, can they carve out a chance? Havertz. Playing advantage here, United keep it. It's going to be United's free kick. He's now got to be extra careful, a verbal warning rather than a caution here. Yeah, the next one, he knows where he's going, in the book. And Kai Havertz. Havertz! 
The goal appeared to be at his mercy, but defenders always have a part to play in these situations. Well, if you can't block the shot, put the forward off, and that's exactly what happened there, but it's just off target. Well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Kai Havertz. Dybala. Hakimi. Oh, a nice looking pass. Tempere. A chance to eat into their lead. What a vital intervention. Cleared away. De Jong. Dybala. Havertz. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. And teammates to play it to. It really is such a free-scoring performance. Just nothing the defenders can do about it, seemingly. Well, I love looking at replays. You get to see the goal in all its glory. Just look at this. Perfect header. What a goal. The ball rolling again in what has been an utterly one-sided match. Hakimi. Manchester United getting higher and higher up the pitch. What can they produce from this position? Mbappe. Can they slot it home? Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Well, he'll be getting thumbs up all round for the goalkeeping performance, but especially for that save. Absolutely brilliant, Derek, wasn't it? It's with Diallo. And it's with Etebo. Well, he has clear options in the middle. Not really the ideal clearance. Might be able to set up the chance. The offside flag had to go up, and it did. Yeah, look along the line. Look along the line. Throw-ins given. Woods with it. With Dybala, breaking at pace. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Frey, moving into the advanced position. A very good tackle. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Mbappe, Kai Havertz. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Two minutes. And a very good challenge. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. Well, as we see, this is probably the best angle. He's picked his spot, he didn't change his mind, and the keeper's got no chance. So the current scoreline, 4-2. That's it, the referee brings the action to an end. Joao Felix.